Because you brought Shane along on your uh, nautical murder mystery adventure. I mean, no offense, but is it wise to be bringing coworkers along and like this? Oh, well, he's more than a flight attendant. I mean, it's he's not really, he's... Cassie, Cassie, no, no. He's CIA, he's a CIA agent. Are you kidding me right now? Okay. For real? I'm sorry, they're the last people I tell, I promise. Okay, stop making promises that you clearly cannot keep. I'm sorry. Can we get to work? Well, again, looks like we're back. Uh, that was a clip from The Flight Attendant, which is streaming right now on HBO Max. Congratulations on the show. Thank you. Now, I love the first season so Thank much. Thank you. The first season was so brilliant, so perfect. Did you always know when you were shooting season one that you were that you were going to carry on the story? No. And make a second, really? Oh, my God, no. That was a one and done for me. It was right. a limited in my mind. Um, and when it did well, I was like, you guys, like, we got away with it. I wanted to, like, run away and, like, tie it in a bow and forget it happened. Yeah. Because, um, you know, you don't want to, like, question it was good. Like, I don't want to sure. try and do it again. Um, and then they, you know, came up with some wild, wacky storyline that I'd play five versions of myself. And for some reason, I said yes to that insanity. <laughs> and I won't do that again. No. And um, we ended up with this really fun, wild season. So I kind of can't believe we did another. So it was not my goal or my thought. Although one thing I will say I am very, very much enjoying and looking forward to is the fact that Sharon Stone plays your mum yeah. in the show. Yeah, I'm that was wild. Yeah. I love her so much. And you, is this right? You made her a gift. Yes. So I make coffee mugs as gifts. Actually, my amazing assistant helps me make these coffee mugs, <laughs> but I gift them a lot, and, I, and people like to give me mugs. And so I had heard that she really likes to have a real coffee mug in her trailer, and of course, this is my time to shine. So I was like, I'm gonna make her a mug. And I thought it'd be funny to do like, you know, when you go to the glam, the mall with the glam shots. Yeah. So we super, I super, well, Emma, my sister, <laughs> superimposed so our look, heads on other people's bodies. Here and they are, here, funny. Look. Sharon Stone. And, and I left it in her room. Look. That is amazing. Says number one mom. Now we shot together all day and she didn't say anything to me and I thought, oh my God, she doesn't <laughs> like the mug. Don't. This is the worst, biggest mistake of my life. That's all I can think about all day shooting. Did she see the mug? And then we wrap for the day and she gives me a hug. Oh my God, and she goes, hey, that mug was awesome. How'd you do that? I was like, really? Did you like it? I've been worried about it all day. She loved it, but how ridiculous is this? Well, can I tell you one thing? Yes. So when you say you make mugs. Yeah. <laughs> You Emma didn't, makes you mugs. Didn't, you no, didn't I make didn't, I didn't like make pottery. So you yeah. don't make mugs. What I wasn't you, like a color no. me mine There's making no a mug. There's no bit of this no. to you make mugs. Okay. What you do is you tell your assistant, yeah. here's a funny idea. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. You, so, I mean... Yeah. Let's give a hand for Emma. Yeah. <laughs> Nailed it, Emma. The email I put together to ask to do it took me hours. Yeah. Do you, do you give rap gifts to your co-stars? Yeah, I, I, I like to do rap gifts. I think my favorite rap gift that I've gotten was uh, uh, Jamie Lee Curtis when I when I did a show called Scream Queens. Uh huh. Um, our, my first scene scene on the show is we're in bed, right? It's like a sex scene for the two of us. And in the middle of it, she asked me, "Have you seen the movie Perfect?" And I was like, uh, "No." She's like, "You should watch Perfect." And so. <laughs> She kept following up with me about, you know, watching Perfect. <laughs> um, one thing she did give me is a uh, not safe for work sort of contraception with her uh, her uh, face on it. Uh, the other the other thing was the DVD Perfect. Oh, um, hang on, so yeah. go back. No, no, no. I don't think we will. The DVD's less interesting. So the, she gave you a condom. <laughs> she gave you a condom with her face on it. I she love said, that. She said, thanks for the ride of a lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> you never know what you're going to get on this show.